hello everyone in today's tutorial i'm going to make a stopwatch and then i will add texture to it so to model and texture a stopwatch on blender let's open the blender app go to add menu and i will add a cylinder rotate it scale it down select the face selector then i will select this front face press i and exit then press e and extrude it inside and then go to add menu and again i will add a cylinder and then scale down it move it along the axis again scale down Press 7 to see the top view and then I will adjust its position. Go to edit mode. Select the face selector. Select this top face and scale up. Then press E and extrude it. After this select this edge selector and I will select all these edges. After selecting them go to select and then check deselect. Then press S and scale up. Go to object mode and then I will add a bevel modifier. Add a bevel modifier and in the segments I will add 3 segments. Go to add menu and this time I will add a torus. After adding this torus, scale down, move it along the axis and then rotate. Go to edit mode. Press Alt S and scale down like this. Again go to object mode, then select this surface and then press Shift to duplicate. Then press G and X, move it along X axis and then move it along Z axis. Select the rotate tab and rotate. Fix it on the stopwatch surface. After adjusting its position, next go to edit remove the modifier and then I will add a subdivision surface modifier add some cuts increase level viewpoint and apply the modifier again duplicate it and move it along x axis and then rotate and adjust its position on the stopwatch next I'm going to add material and then I will add image of stopwatch press here to select all add a new material in the metallic I will add one in the base color decrease the intensity then select this surface go to edit mode select the face selector select this front face add another material in the base color i will select image texture and then open the image which we are downloading from google after opening this image i will see the shader view and in the uv i will select q projection and then open the uv and then i will select this uv editor zoom out then press a to select all and then i will scale down to fix the picture on the stopwatch press g and z and move the picture to its position so stopwatch image is properly adjusted on its position next go to object mode close the uv so you can see stopwatch is ready hope you enjoyed the video if you enjoyed the video show your reaction in the comment section and if you want our services connect us on the linkedin see you in the next video bye bye